this logical sequencing how it will work out and why it is necessary why it is necessary already I explained just now it is framework then ideation idea unit if that way you are learning then only you will able to able to develop the good vocabulary now how this process will be there how this process will work out then to work out this process just i will trigger one kind one different type of thinking just sudden shift means ho sakta hai ki earlier you were traveling on the state highway now it has come to nh national highway we are shifting now just i am think just i am uh, forcing you to think for few questions which is very open ended questions are because this will be our triggering point for thinking this logical sequencing of the vocabulary without understanding these small background we will not able to understand this sequencing process what would we be for god i don't know if you know you can think what is god i surrendered i don't know god is everything how god had been created this universe sochte raho what we will get answer <laughs> we don't know what is the beyond god pata nahi apne marne ka pata nahi beyond god who will knows what will happen after death we are alive that itself a great gift after death our brain is not capable to think what is beyond our universe apne ghar ka rasta bhul jate universe ke beyond kya hai pata nahi can we give any of the answer in exact way no can any group of people or any religious people or any particular national national uh, nationality people can you expect they will able to give correct answer no can you expect any of the professors from high very uh, you can say top university of london or america are they able to give answer no why because answer is either nothing or we don't know life is a very small game which is starting with we don't know it will end with we don't know in between we will think we know everything although we know it is a like a droplets of water and that realization will come once you are keep on learning once you are keep on knowing once you will start to start to learn or start to gain the knowledge then you will keep on gain the knowledge then you will think i don't know anything i don't know anything i will just share one anecdote uh one point of time one uh, big musician was there i don't want to quote his name he was uh, playing the sitar from last 25 years 25 to 30 years well known national level person i met during one event then i asked you are a very much you can say legendary in your area how you become legend is how you are recognized in that way and how you are able to maintain your interest in 25 years then he told now i just made all the preparation how to make the sitar how to play the sitar i become totally shocked i became totally shocked in 25 years after 25 years of practice and that much you can say legendary status he is telling i just prepared how to play the sitar you too i am telling once you will start to learn or once you will start to gain the knowledge slowly slowly you will realize we don't know we don't know anything then uh, most of the time we will land here nothing or we don't know means our journey will start from nothing we will end in nothing nothing only we know after big bang or collision of two universe these two theory are there to you can say uh about the universe means how universe has come in picture who has created the universe how universe has created then these two theory are there big bang collision of two universe these two theory itself a contradictory big bang they don't have any data before explosion what happened they are only telling just sudden explosion happened and everything is created i think uh, as a science student or as a mathematics student nobody will able to ac accept it ki nothing was there something happened suddenly explosion happened and full universe is created it is not like a dosa or idli ki humne dala aur create ho gaye it is a big universe and our like earth earth itself is like a point on this screen this point also will not there this earth i am not telling your house or my apartment 
it is not like that it is like full earth size will not like uh, this dot also it will be you can say 100 part or 1000 part of this dot that earth itself then big bang having own pros and cons for acceptance by the different scientific community second theory is there collision of two universe that itself is giving the contradiction if two universe was there and they have collided and third universe whatever we are living now that is created then how these two universes come in picture before these two universe what was there and how these two universe created this question is again open ended then nothing to universe anyway from nothing to universe has come we will accept it then here one simple question we will ask who has created if we don't know anything we will just put one unknown thing unknown power that is called god either you, you are telling brahma or you are telling shiva or you are telling jehova you are telling isha or you are telling allah anyway this is god means between nothing and universe god has entered hero hero has entered then between nothing and universe god has come in picture and we are assuming this universe is created by god means a story is starting from here and this is our the nodal point of logical sequencing of vocabulary we will start with learning from nothing we will end with nothing but between this journey from nothing to nothing we will learn almost 